So right, Mum, have a lie-in. I'll make you a brew. Hey, those were already weighed out. I think you said the boss was over everything. If he finds out that bag's light... Well, I should have played everything by Harvey's rules, hmm? What, just... Just let him walk all over me? Yeah, from what you've said, I think he literally would. Well... Won't find out, will he? Get yourself some new trainers and, um Get your mum a mop and a bucket. This place is a tip. So who's Harvey? And is he going to be showing up next? No, and I've never met him. <sighs> Jacob's right. This place is a tip. It's fine. Everything's going to be fine. All right, Jumpy. Follow me. I've had enough of this. All of it. You know, I should be sat here looking at this rug, remembering playing with Oliver, not picking up pills off the floor. Mum, chill. Look. Got money. Food. We're gonna be okay. I just don't see a good way out of this, I. Si. Don't worry. There will be. Trust me. Do you speak to Jacob? What's happened? I got a message from him asking me to meet him. When I got there, Harvey turned up. Harvey? Yeah. He said he put Jacob in hospital for stealing his pills. He was really angry. He wanted to know if I'd been stealing from him too. And what did you tell him? I told him no. He would have battered me otherwise. Oh, Sai. Right, that is it. You are nothing more to do with this gang, is that clear? I have to. Sai, this is serious. These people are dangerous. I can't get out of it, though, can I, Mum? He says I've got to step up. Well, you tell him no. I tried, but he told me I owe him two grand. Two grand? What for? For the lost drugs. Yeah, but that wasn't your fault. Yeah, I know. But he says I've got to pay him back. And if I don't turn up for the next pickup, he's going to put me in hospital and all. What am I going to do? Uh, we'll, we'll sort something out. I don't see how. I'm trapped. And I've trapped us both. I don't see a way out of this. I'm gonna have to do what he says. Well, there is a way out. What? We go to the police. <laughs> I can't do that. Sai, I should have done it before. I shouldn't have let this happen. It's my fault you're in this mess. I just let it go on. We'll no more. I can't go to the police, Mum. I have been delivering drugs. Sai, you were groomed. There's probably thousands of kids in the same boat as you. The police know how these gangs work. What if Harvey finds out? Well, he won't do anything. As soon as he finds out they're onto him, he'll stay clear. And what if he doesn't? He could come round here. He could come after you. I can't let him do that. Sai, if we don't go to the police, you are never going to get out of this gang. And they're always going to have a hold on you. And we'll always be in danger. Is that what you want? It's the only way to end this, believe me. Right, you ready? Don't answer it. Sai, we don't know who it is. Yeah, and what if it's Harvey? Well, he's no reason to come round here in any way. He said he'd call. Oh. Right, cheers. Hiya. Oh, yeah. Someone was leaving, so I just came up. Any chance you could cover a shift at the chip shop? Jacob's a no-show. All right. You don't know where he is, do you? No, sorry. Uh, we were just going out for a meal. Can somebody else cover? Well, I can't. Neither can Asha. She's at the hospital, apparently. That Kelly girl collapsed, took some drugs or something. Is she okay? I think so, but Dev was in a rush, so. Listen, mate, are you sure you can't cover? Ah, oh, sorry, Chez. Uh, we made a booking. Can't cancel. All right. No worries. See if I can persuade Bernie to give up bingo. <laughs> Wish me luck. See ya. I can't go to the police now. Oh, well, why not? Because I sold Kelly pills earlier. You did what? The one she found under the sofa. She was asking me for drugs and I told her no, but she threatened to tell everybody that I was a dealer. What else could I have done? I don't believe this. That's why she's collapsed. Well, then all the more reason to go to the police. These pills are dangerous. Yeah, and I'm the one who sold them to her. If I go to the police now, I'll get arrested. I'm not doing it. <sighs> 
Si, stop it. Come on, just no, sit down. I can't. I've got to go. I've got to get out of here. Well, running away is not going to solve anything, is it? Where are you going to go? I don't know. But if I stay here, I'll either get arrested for dealing or beaten to a pulp. Well, if we go to the police, explain no, the situation... they'll arrest me. ...and they'll realise the pressure you've been under. Yeah, and if they release me, Harvey will figure out I've been dealing behind his back and he'll go berserk. <laughs> you see, that'll be him now. I'm trapped. I've got to go. Stop. No. Call him back. You are? I've got an idea. He says I've got to meet him tomorrow. I don't want to do this. Well, you don't have to. I'll go instead. You can't. What are you going to do, tell him off? I'm sorry, he's dangerous. You said it yourself. I'm not going to tell him off. I'm going to pay him off. How? Well, don't worry, we'll, we'll find the money somehow. But we're skint. That was the whole reason I was doing this. Yeah, for me. This is my fault. I should never have let you get involved with those people. You put yourself on the line, and I let that happen because I was so wrapped up in my own grief to notice. Well, not anymore, Si. I'm going to start behaving like your mum, and we're going to sort this out. <laughs>